Girl, ChatGPT just updated their image generator. So I'm gonna be showing you three new ways to use ChatGPT's image tool to create books for Amazon KDP. So the first way is if you like this simple, bold, and easy style artwork for your coloring book pages, then ChatGPT's new image generator tool is perfect to create that style artwork. For example, the prompt I put in was a black and white cat wearing a scarf sitting by a window with a warm cup of tea outside the window snow is falling and a small bookshelf with, with plants is nearby. The design should be whimsical, engaging and intricate, but not too overly detailed with clean, high contrast outlines, perfect for coloring. And this is the image that it generated. Isn't that so cute? That is the cutest little cat ever. And this is another example of the simple and easy coloring book style that's really popular on Amazon right now. So the second new way that you can use ChatGPT's image tool for um, Amazon KDP, and this one is one of my favorites, which is, is you can now ask ChatGPT to generate a colored image of that same coloring book page. So in the past, when using ChatGPT to create coloring book pages, one of the things that discouraged some people was that they could never get their cover page, just like the interior coloring book page. But now you can. So for example, when I use this coloring page that I generated, I said, now take this coloring page and generate a fully colored version using vibrant and engaging colors. And then this is what it gave me. Voila. Y'all, this is really a great tool. But one thing I do want to show you is, let's say for example, I am putting in a prompt for a new image. So I'm gonna say a black and white bold line art coloring page featuring a cozy scene with a cute black woman wearing a scarf sitting by a window with a warm cup of tea. Outside the window, snow is falling and a small bookshelf with plants is nearby. The design should be whimsical, engaging and intricate, but not overly detailed with clean, high contrast outlines for perfect coloring. Similar to the other prompt, the only thing I really changed was um, I added a cute black woman instead of a cat. So I'm going to go ahead and press enter so that we can generate this prompt because I want to show y'all that even though the tool has been upgraded, it is relatively slow with generating images because when you would generate images before, all you would do is put in the prompt and the image would just pop right up. But the reason that the image was able to pop right up because they were using um, a tool called Dali. And so it was generating it through like a third party host from what I understand. But now with the updated tool, they're using it inside of ChatGPT. So this is new because it was just released like a few days ago. So with all AI tools, it'll probably get better and it'll probably end up speeding up some, but I just wanted to show you in real time how long it's taken to just generate this one image. So we're just gonna sit here and wait so that y'all can see. So look though, while we're waiting, I just wanted to remind you guys that I have a host of free step-by-step -step tutorials on my YouTube channel that you can watch that helps you publish and create books on Amazon KDP, as well as market and sell your KDP coloring books, journals, any type of book that you create using Amazon KDP. And so girl, this is still generating, so I'm not gonna make y'all wait like that. While this is generating, I'm gonna go ahead and show you the third new way that you can use ChatGPT's image tool to create for Amazon KDP. And that is creating inspirational coloring pages. If you are familiar with ChatGPT and you ever used it before, and you were trying to put words inside of your image, it may have messed up the words. But now I asked ChatGPT, can you create me a coloring page that says, girl, you matter in cursive font? And girl, it created me a coloring page that said, girl, you matter. I'm loving the updates. That other image just got created. So this is how cute that one looks. Like I said, it does take a while, but the end result is so cute. Now I am gonna do a full step-by-step -step tutorial showing you um, a few more things in detail as to how you can use this tool. But I just wanted to go ahead and put this out today for you so that you would at least be able to get started. And let me know in the comments if you're gonna be trying it out. I also wanted to tell you that with ChatGPT, they do have a free plan, but to use the image generator, I am actually using the plus plan, which is a $20 a month plan. But if y'all have been following me, you know that I use ChatGPT 
just like I use Canva, which is like almost every day. I use ChatGPT to ask questions, to give me prompts, to generate images, everything like that. But these are some of the things that are included in that $20 a month plan. So, you know, you can just play around with it. But I would suggest if you do, Plan to create coloring pages. And this is a business that you've been wanting to get into. And I highly suggest giving this um, updated tool a try. Oh yeah, and one more thing I wanted to show you. If you stuck around to the end, I'm going to throw you in this bonus. So I am uploading a picture of myself and I'm going to ask ChatGPT, make this image into a cartoon character. Let's see what it does because these are just some creative ideas that you can use if you are perhaps publishing maybe a children's book or just doing something fun like a comic book, anything like that. I just kind of wanted to get your creative juices flowing so that if you're not actually creating coloring books, you'll also have a few different other ways that you can use this new tool. So like I said, it does take a while. So while that is generating, I'm also going to go ahead and show you how you can even create a meme. So like for your marketing on social media, memes tend to do very well. I ran across this sarcastic meme that I had saw online that said I have started coloring to manage my stress and anxiety. They were drunk, they were coloring outside of the lines, meaning that they really needed to manage their stress and anxiety. And so I asked ChatGPT, can you make me a meme of a coloring page of a black woman relaxing with circle frame glasses over her eyes, scribble on the image with a crayon and let the meme say, I have started coloring to manage my stress and anxiety and it actually created a meme. So you can use this tool to even create your own memes. Um, another thing that I did on this meme was I asked it to make the words, I have started coloring to manage my stress and anxiety in a coloring font. And it even made the words in a coloring font. So yeah, y'all got a lot to play around with. Now let me go back to that other image and see if that's finished generating yet. <laughs> that is super cute. Y'all, it made me into a cartoon holding my little book. Yo, that is so cute. It's still finishing it up, but that's so cute. I actually think it was one more thing that I wanted to show y'all. So we went from this to this. I love creative stuff like this. Don't y'all love stuff like this? Drop a comment and say, I think I'm gonna like this. Now this next thing I'm gonna show you isn't altogether new, but you can even click on the image. And once you click on the image, you can click on select here to edit the image. So if you wanted to edit any part of the image, you can do one of two things. You can either go in and highlight the part you want to edit. And so it kind of clips that part. I'm gonna say, can you add an Afro with curly hair? And let's see what it gives me. Also, when you're editing, um, if we come back to that tool, it says that you can describe what you want to add, remove, or replace. Remove the background color and replace it with blue. All right, so now we're still, we're just waiting on the um, afro with the curly hair and then the blue background color. Y'all, I'll be reading y'all comments. Listen, y'all comments are just as inspirational as the videos that you're telling me that I'm putting out for you guys. Y'all, the fact that y'all are taking the content and actually creating and publishing your books, I absolutely love that for you. And I want you to keep going because KDP does not have a limit of how many high quality books you can make on their platform. So even if you publish one book and it doesn't get the amount of sales that you may be looking to get, as you continue to publish, you will start knowing what to look for to create better books as well as better titles and subtitles and keywords for your books. And so you don't have to stop at just one. You can create series of books. And if you haven't created your book yet, why not, sis? What are you waiting for? This is your year. All right, so it's still generating the um, girl with the afro, but because it has already generated the second image that I requested, which was to make the, the background blue, it actually went ahead and gave me the girl with the afro and made the background blue. Now, ChatGPT, you added a little weight on me, a couple pounds, didn't you, girl? Um, but it's okay, she's still cute. She got her little afro or whatever. As you can see, these are some of the things that you can create. If you like this type of content, make sure you like and subscribe so that I know to keep putting out more content like this. And until next time, bye-bye.